Hello again, the Sports Betting Whale on Friday, July 7th, 2017. Thanks again for joining me on the YouTube video channel. As uh, you see on the screen here, yesterday I wagered uh, around $25,000 on the picks. And I've been, I've been making picks now for over 30 years. I have um, won millions of dollars a year in some years, totaling tens of millions of dollars over the course of the 30 years. I've had some cold spells. I've also had some unbelievable hot streaks. And the hot streaks always well compensate, overcompensate for any cold spells. So right now we're experiencing a cold spell, but as the seasons change and the weather, I mean, that's the reality of what, what happens uh, as a sports handicapper. Sports handicapping is not for the faint of heart. It definitely is an emotional roller coaster. It's so much fun when we're winning and it can be really, really disheartening when we're down. The reason I do this, the reason I keep betting so much money, the reason I'm recommending this is because season after season, year after year, I end up ahead. So if you follow with me, you're gonna experience some cold spells, some hot spells. Like I said the other day, there's times that it doesn't even appear I can lose, and there's other times it doesn't even appear like now that I can win. But look at the overall track record, and you'll see that the hot streaks come, and they come in a big way, and if you use the progression techniques and put money aside during the hot streaks, you'll be playing on house money. We will be catching a hot streak soon, very, very close many, many times. It is zero in and it will overcompensate. We'll start getting actually getting some lucky on some games that maybe uh, we shouldn't have won that we will win. So it'll, it'll all even out and at the end, we'll all end up way ahead year after year. So I'm looking for people that have the ability to stick in with me and, and ride this out and don't get too emotional when we're up, don't get too emotional when we're down and we'll uh, make a lot of money together. We have a question that came in. What's your advice on betting the totals in baseball? I noticed that you wagered on many overs up until recently and that has slowed down. At what point is it wise to start switching to betting on the under? There are a lot of people that do bet on the unders and occasionally I do bet on the unders in, in baseball. But if you think about what can happen in a game and you know, you've got errors, you've got walks, you've got hit um, batsmen, you have uh, wild pitches, the uh, wind conditions, a uh, routine fly ball can end up being a home run, which we've seen a lot of lately. I am just haven't had much luck when it comes to betting unders. It seems like too many things can make a game go over and not as many things can make a game go under. Again, there are people that, that do bet unders and I'm, I'm just not one of them. I would say you'll see that I'm looking for the power matchups where both teams are hitting well against um, mediocre or poor pitchers. And in uh, the other sports too, you'll see that I'm looking for the teams that are scoring well and hot. Those are the kind of teams I want. I don't like so much to be betting on the fact that uh, nothing's going to happen. And again, that's just a personal preference and I've done well with my side and over uh, combinations. I've won a lot of money using that approach and that's why I do it that way. Okay, so got a first inning, first five innings uh, round robin for you today that you, you should be able to get uh, after watching this. Uh, Mets first five innings, Arizona first five innings, Nationals first five innings, and over on the Astros first five innings. That's the Mets, Arizona, Nationals, and over on the Astros all first five innings on a round robin play for today. Feel very, very good about it. Hopefully it comes in and we get on a nice streak. I know we all want it and I'm counting on it just as much as you are and I'm putting up, I think I'm betting more myself than anyone else that I'm aware of in the whole whale system. So that shows you how I feel about the plays and my confidence going forward. Thank you very much. See you again soon. Going forward, I'll continue to release all of my daily picks to you for free if you text me or subscribe to my mailing list. So make sure to text me or subscribe to my free mailing list so I can continue sending you all of my picks every day. I've made tens of millions of dollars betting on sports over the years and now I'm finally breaking my secret so that you too can share in my success. All you have to do is either click on the link in the description of this video or send me a text message to my phone number at 
702-462-1135. If you're texting me from outside the United States, add the plus one, so it's plus one, 702-462-1135. I will begin texting and emailing you with all of my daily picks whenever they come up. Remember, subscribing to my mailing list is 100% free, no strings attached. And every day that you're not a subscriber to my free mailing list is another day that you may have missed out on one of my devastating winning runs. So be sure to click on the link in the description of this video or send me a text at 702-462-1135 or if you're outside of the United States, plus one, 702-462-1135 to join my mailing list today, 100% free. And you'll be the first to know when I release my killer picks every single day, again. 100% free.